All right, so here we are. It's April, and beginning of April is April 1st, so April Fool's Day. So I didn't really plan ahead or anything, no elaborate pranks or really anything going on. Um, saw a little mischievousness-ness. Mischievousness? Mischievousness-ness. I did get a text in the morning um, from my mom, actually, um, saying, Happy April Fool's uh, exclamation point. So a little bit of holiday cheer. But overall, my story begins in the evening. Uh, so traditionally, April Fool's um, kind of runs until noontime. And then after that, there's no fooling to be happening. Th those are the rules according to the, the April Fool's, April Fool's people. Fools, the April, the April Fool's. So, this evening um, of April 1st, I was uh, invited to a bridal shower. Beforehand, I was getting some things ready and getting the gift together. I had this object of the bride's. Um, it was a fan that belonged to her and just needed to get back to her. So I figured, it's April Fool's. She likes jokes. Why not get this back in a creative way? So I took the fan and I put a bow on the fan and I got the gift together. There was a few other things with the fan. There was um, a mug. Oh, I, I have one of those mugs. Uh, one of these actually, that I also own. It's a little bit dirty. There's some coffee in it. She also had a portable alarm clock. All things that were at camp that I brought back. So I was getting the things together and kind of like playing around with the alarm clock, wrapped everything up, went to the bridal shower. Um, I walk in, I put the fan on the table with the gifts. I think it's hilarious. No one else really gets it. I also put the gift bag on the table. So the night's going, there's some, there's some games and fun happening, um, but suddenly there's this like beeping noise coming from the gifts. Beep, 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 beep. And everyone's like, where's that coming from? Someone's gift is going off. The people sitting by the gifts were kind of afraid that there was some kind of um, explosive device. And then I realized I packed away an alarm clock and when I was playing with the alarm clock, I actually set the alarm. I set the alarm to the time. <laughs> and at this point, um, you know, do you say something? Do you go over and fix it? And everyone else is kind of wondering like, what's going on? Um, overall, I just left it. So this beeping is is happening and I'm just hoping that it that it stops on its own. And it does. So fortunately it does. And things keep going. The 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 night is still young. Things are happening. Later on, uh she goes to to open the gifts and pulls out the the mug and the alarm clock and kind of figures out like oh the beeping. You know, overall it was all in good fun. The moral of the story is that no pranking should be done after noon on April Fools and don't give people gifts of things they already own. It's probably a good idea. Especially when there's other, other people in the room that thinks you're just giving them random things. So that's all I have for my beginning of April story. So yeah. Um, it's a little bit dirty. There's some coffee in it. I need, I need to wash my mug. Yep, so that's all I have for my beginning of April story. Uh, I want to hear a story from you, Chris and Holly. Uh, yeah. <laughs>